Hello. Well, welcome to Maui. I'm enjoying this day, the day after Christmas, and I'm doing a little field test to see which types of, of um, portable learning pro, um, elements or devices, mobile devices are, seem to be use, most useful for online education. So right now I'm looking at a little t test between my new BlackBerry Curve and my iTouch. Now the thing about the iTouch is that it is extremely user friendly and it seems to be very good at downloading lots of YouTube, um, things from the internet, websites, etc. The downside is you have to have Wi-Fi and it has to be a pretty good connection you have to have access to it. So the typical wireless here at, say, the Marriott, Hawaiian is not really workable, which is kind of sad. Okay, but I can I can download things from iTunes. Now, here I've got my trusty BlackBerry Curve, and I'm telling you, this has turned out to be a lifesaver for um, e-learning mobile devices. I can use the camera, see? I can also get my email. I can also download things. I need to have data, lots of data, um, downloadable capabilities, though, because it's, it's, it can be expensive, but thankfully I have a pretty good plan. But this is really good. See, right now it indicates I have email. I can check to see my e new email messages and see what's, what's going on. I can download things from the Internet. I can type onto the little type pad and even respond, sending text messages. I can upload to Facebook, etc. So this is pretty useful, depending on what the purpose is and what the learning objectives are. I think this is really the best for communicating the, the BlackBerry um, curve, whereas the um, whereas the iPod, the iTouch, is really best for storing and retrieving and reviewing um, instructional content. So I hope this has been useful. Talk to you soon.